Hello, this is Jess, and this is a recap, day 219, August 6, 2020, which would be a, a Thursday, and uh, just went through the normal um, routine, um, added in some mowing, um, but we're Maintaining the farm, that's all we're able to do at this time. So that's where we are. Doing what we can to push to the next uh, thing. Um, really, this is just a crazy. Uh, all the news on Thursday and, and prior to that even. I mean, the stuff with with Trump and and uh, it's just crazy that a person who has done um, the negative things in our country as president um, is still recognized as a great president by folks when everything, the facts and the truth stand to say different. Are you allowed to like somebody? It's not me to tell you who to like. Um, but are you allowing yourself to understand the truth? To to understand why it's even more critical for the president to be a liar than it is for me to be a liar. On a national stage, you know, he's representing Americans. And yet he continues to re wreak havoc in our treaties and in our alliances and in our position in the world and then there's going to be a global market you know it's already there and uh, we don't want to be isolated from it wouldn't be a very good thing you know what I mean so if you believe in the president we have and you think that he's the man for the job then Get truth and facts, and good luck if he wins again. It's like it's like this guy has some kind of trick over people. I don't get it. I don't understand. Is it just something they're putting in the food? Is it something they're putting in the water? Is it something, something, something? I just don't understand how a person can just not go to a senator's funeral, just ignore subpoenas, tell people to ignore subpoenas, talk to the people that are in the in the system to be asked questions at hearings and tell them what to say and tell them to ignore and tell them not to go. You have the vice president coming out and saying, hey, you know, we fucking put you in there. Uh, in the Supreme Court, you know, and, and he hasn't voted the way that they want him to, and so now they're all pissed off. And I think that's a big joke anyway. Um, Supreme Court justices shouldn't have life sentences. They should have three terms. Um, I think that... <sighs> I think the senators should have three terms. So... I am for that, all this other crap, and I also think that if you elected to the Senate or whatever to the House, you're you know you're a representative in our Congress, that you serve one term and then don't get reelected, you get twenty percent of your salary. You get a reelected, you serve a second term, you get forty percent of your salary. And if you get elected and you 
go for your full term, three term limit, you get 60% of your salary. And you go into a pool and choose from your health insurance like everybody else. Just me making some simple suggestions. All this crap about serving one fucking term as a senator or House of Representatives and, and uh, in the Congress and you you walk away with the full benefits, man. The full right after just serving one four-year term, you can go in there and be a fuck-off and then just walk away from that and have a full salary, full benefits, the whole nine yards from our government. That is such fraud, waste, and abuse. Just my opinion. Uh, the weather Thursday was uh, good. We, it never got hot. It rained a little. Mostly just cloudy. Um, but it was cool, so it wasn't so bad working the same as today. It rained early, but it dried up enough for me to mow this evening to finish off the mowing job. And uh, So we had rain off and on yesterday. But that's about it. Um, this is for Thursday, and uh, like I said, it wasn't anything major. Just a normal Thursday routine with all the nonsense going on all over the world. People just acting out with guns and brawls breaking out with makeshift weapons. And it's just, everyone needs to chill out, man. Isn't anyone else tired of working all day where they just can't go and fight after work or whatever? I don't know. Come on. It's all good to grip, bro. We can do this. Alright, it's Jess and I'm out.